A yearbook full of memories A time to share with friends A hug that says we'll keep in touch One of the great things about Google Classroom is its ability to organize student material in a way that's accessible. So I'm taking a look at this assignment and I can see all my students who have their assignments. It's all automatically connected to me, the teacher, and I can go in and see it. One of the challenges with Google Classroom is there are going to be times when you do want to print something out. So Google Classroom in this platform doesn't make it the easiest, but there is a trick on how to print out all your students' work quickly and easily. If you click this little folder icon right here, that will take us directly to our Google Drive accounts where we'll see that we are in now the first assignment of the class that I'm teaching in a folder that's cl marked Classroom in my Google Drive. All of my students' assignments are here. If I want to print out all of my students' work, what I can do is select everything. So I'm just clicking and dragging across everything. Now I'm going to do a two-finger click on one of them, and I'm going to download. Over down here, we can see that it's preparing to download and it's zipping the 23 files. It's all finished. I see the check mark, and I can see that it is in my downloads folder here. I like to use Finder to see my downloads, and here. I have today's download is this drive download. Now this is one file has all 23 files inside it so I'm going to double click to expand the zipped file which will make a folder right here. Now what you can see that Google Drive did is it created a Word document out of each of the Google Docs and I have all of their names on each one. So Mac doesn't really allow you to print with the greatest of ease. So what we're going to do is we're going to select all the files. And here I'm just going to hit Command A to select everything. And now what I'm going to do is go into System Preferences. System Preferences. And in here go into Printers and Scanners. What we're going to do is we're going to open up the printer queue for the printer that we usually go to. I'll use this one, open print queue, and I'll get a window that looks like all the, where I can put jobs. So all I need to do is click back on my finder window and drag all of my files into this queue to have them print. The this year. 